Please explain in brief the nervous system, organization of the brain, parts of the forebrain, cerebral cortex with lobes and their functions, neurotransmitter and behavior. The nervous system is a complex network of nerves and cells, called neurons, that transmit signals between different parts of the body. It has two main components, the central nervous system, CNS, and the peripheral nervous system, PNS. The CNS consists of the brain and spinal cord, while the PNS includes all other nerves that extend throughout the body. The brain, the control center of the nervous system, is organized into three main regions, the forebrain, midbrain, and hindbrain. The forebrain is the largest and most complex part, consisting of the cerebral cortex, thalamus, and hypothalamus. The midbrain is responsible for coordinating motor movements and auditory and visual processing. The hindbrain includes the cerebellum, pons, and medulla oblongata, which regulate balance, motor coordination, and vital functions such as breathing and heart rate. The cerebral cortex, the outermost layer of the brain, is responsible for higher cognitive functions such as perception, decision-making, and language. It is divided into four main lobes. 1. Frontal lobes. Located at the front of the brain, the frontal lobes are responsible for higher cognitive functions like reasoning, planning, problem-solving, and organizing. They also control voluntary motor movements and are involved in regulating emotions. 2. Parietal lobes, positioned near the top and back of the brain, the parietal lobes process sensory information from the body, like touch, temperature, and pain. They also play a role in spatial awareness, coordination, and the perception of our body's position. 3. Temporal lobes, located on the sides of the brain, the temporal lobes are involved in auditory processing, memory formation, and the integration of sensory information. They also play a role in emotional responses and language processing. 4. Occipital lobes, positioned at the back of the brain. The occipital lobes are responsible for visual processing, including the interpretation of colors, shapes, and movements. Neurotransmitters are chemical messengers that transmit signals across synapses, the tiny gaps between neurons. They play a crucial role in the function of the nervous system and impact behavior, mood, and cognition. Some key neurotransmitters include 1. Acetylcholine. Involved in muscle movement, learning, and memory, acetylcholine is abundant in the neuromuscular junctions and the CNS. A decline in acetylcholine production is associated with Alzheimer's disease. 2. Dopamine. This neurotransmitter is vital for regulating reward, motivation, and movement. Imbalances in dopamine are linked to Parkinson's disease and addictive behaviors. 3. Serotonin. Often called the feel-good neurotransmitter, serotonin contributes to mood regulation, appetite, sleep, and cognitive functions. Low serotonin levels are associated with depression and anxiety disorders. 4. Norepinephrine. This neurotransmitter plays a role in alertness, attention, and stress response. It is also involved in the fight-or-flight response, increasing heart rate and blood pressure during stressful situations. 5. Glutamate and GABA. Glutamate is the primary excitatory neurotransmitter in the CNS, promoting neural communication and playing a role in learning and memory. GABA, on the other hand, is the main inhibitory neurotransmitter, helping to maintain balance by reducing neuronal excitability. In summary, the nervous system is a vast and intricate network that enables communication between different parts of the body. The brain, particularly the cerebral cortex, is responsible for higher cognitive functions and is organized into lobes that specialize in various tasks. Neurotransmitters, as chemical messengers, play a crucial role in the function of the nervous system and impact behavior, mood, and cognition.